Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Poigi here, getting ready to take out the Japanese 1.3 Key 27 Atsu in Air Arcade. Um, let's see, plus column for this. It climbs well, it's fast, and it can turn pretty well if you use the flaps. Uh, the negative column, it can't take damage very well. Any shots that you take are, you know, pretty effective against this plane. And it only has the two 7.7 millimeter guns. So, having said all that, let's take it out and see what we can do. The map is coursing. We've got our stealth ammo, 800 meter targeting distance, and minimum fuel load. Put on the wep, climb at 30 degrees. Got the engine injection now, so it climbs very well. And then let's see who we're up against. So 1020 match, it's a mostly up tier. Couple bombers on their side. Climb's going to do two things for us. It's going to make it so that we've got an energy advantage over any of the uh, opponents that don't climb. And it's also going to make it so we're not the first target that they go after. I've been playing this more or less as a turn fighter. I think let's try using it as an energy fighter and see how it does. I don't usually like to energy fight with uh, weak guns on a plane. It's hard to get kills. But this thing can outclimb and outspeed most anything out here, so. Let's do our first pass. Looks like the HE-112. He broke off. Peace shooter. Huge energy advantage over him. No hits that I saw. There we go. Got the assist. We go vertical. Turn that speed back into energy. Potential energy, I should say. And pick our next target. So, two of them down here. Gladiator's always slow. And the 112 are catching up to pretty easy. I don't think he knows we're here. He's focused on killing one of our buddies. Gladiator's still alive. Let's dive on him. Nice stall for us, appreciate it. Let's go head over towards the B2C. Yeah, we're still over 200 miles per hour. This is, uh, now that I've tried it, energy fighting is the right way to fly this plane. Get in trouble sometimes with the Japanese aircraft. I think, well, they're known for their turning, so I'll just turn with it. Um, it's not the case for some of them. Better energy fighters. All right, so we're on their side of the battlefield, which we normally wouldn't want to do, but we have such an energy advantage, it doesn't matter as much. Even the people coming out of their spawn, we can run away from if we need to. Let's check on this Fury. He's shooting at our buddy, which means he's distracted. We like distracted. Makes our job a lot easier. Got shot a little bit. Let's go straight up into the vertical. Sorry, he's not going to be able to stay with us. And it sets him up nicely for our teammates that want to help us. Alright, Key 10's up here with us. In that shit. That's the other bad part about being on their side of the map. You lose a lot with the radar. It's not so obvious. Uh, it's hard to distinguish between their ground units and their air units. Whereas if you're on your side of the map, it's only air units, so it's easy to know where they're at. Alright, diving down on the key tent. I appreciate him shooting at us. We'll have a short but meaningful conversation about it. I think he understands that now. Alright, in the vertical. Turn our speed back into altitude. Get ready to flip back down on those two. If you're poisoned, either one of them is a good opportunity. Back to the vertical. Fury's on his way down.
Their A is more of a problem than their planes right now. The nice thing about this map is nobody seems to be hitting grounds. So, get a much longer time to play, which I prefer. Don't think he saw us or just didn't think we'd do anything, I guess. Uh, he's on his way down. Check this HE 51. Got a good energy advantage, shouldn't have any trouble catching him. He's down. E26. Catching him as well. He's down. Yeah, definitely energy fight with this plane. It's just so fast. Alright, so we ended up with eight air kills, uh, one assist, got survivor, most kills without dying, and first place in the team. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll catch y'all next one. America! Fuck yeah! To save this fucking day, yeah! Beautiful.